guys, it's Amy. Welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a tag video called the 5 least used luxury item uh, 2.0. I was tagged by the lovely Minnie. Thank you Minnie for tagging me to redo this tag because I had already done this video a couple years ago. But the things that I'm going to feature are a lot different than what I used to, uh, well, than what I did feature in my past video simply because my collection has changed so much. But one thing did remain, one of my least used handbags is in here and I'm sure a lot of you can probably guess I still have it. It is my Alma PM in Epi Leather. As you can see, it is in mint condition, but uh, that is also the reason why it is my least used, mostly because I'm not very much a handheld handbag person and also um, yeah when I bought this bag I didn't know a lot about LV bags and I was just attracted to this one at the time I'm pretty sure I already mentioned that before that I am pretty much a small bag person and if I needed something bigger then I'll just go with a really big bag such as a tote um, so I, I love using my Neverfull for that I love using my new a uh, new-ish Deauville tote for that and so that's the reason why you'll see that I am pretty much featuring all my medium bags however this one is also a tote bag and this is a limited edition Longchamp tote and this is the large size I believe with the long handles one thing that really really bothers me about Longchamp totes is this, li this little kind of flap here um, I find that I love the zipper because I love having security when I travel when I use this bag but whenever I want to open it quickly uh, this thing really gets in the way I don't close it when I'm using it but it still does get in the way it hasn't softened up obviously because I don't use it very often and also I think because this is a limited edition it does have a different leather it does add to the aesthetic of it so I love it, I, I have it, I do use it once in a while but I don't use it very often. The next thing I'm going to feature is actually my Emily wallet and I don't know if it'll surprise some of you but I'm pretty sure I mentioned several times uh, in the past that I pretty much don't use a wallet anymore, I only use a card holder so I, I do love the slim card holder that I have from LV and that's all I need. And so this wallet, although I do love it because you know, it, it's a really good wallet. It's it's one of the slimmest, a smartphone and a couple cards you can really get by. You just need your ID and like a major credit card or debit card. You really can get by every day on a daily basis. So something like this is more sort of heavy duty. It, it, it's great for someone who needs to carry everything, who likes to carry cash. Uh, I don't carry cash anymore. So um, I haven't, I really haven't been using this for a long 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 time actually and I still just keep it just because you never know maybe one day I will go back to a full-size wallet and also I just I just I don't know when you when you get something good at LV because you know how like sometimes you hear a lot of glazing quality issues and whatnot I haven't had any on this one so I'm definitely keeping it for this reason my next bag is my speedy b25 and I know you're what you're thinking you're like this is a brand new bag, duh. but um, I'm featuring it just because I still had a Speedy 25 before. It's just in a different print. So I guess technically it's a different bag because this one is my new bag that I just got in Europe. I'm featuring it because of the model of the bag. So like I mentioned, I, I used to own the Speedy B25 in Damier Ben. This is the monogram version. And the reason why, <laughs> the reason why I picked this up is because I wanted the more comfortable straps and yes I've mentioned several times that I do find the opening to be quite annoying and very constricting I still think so but I really like the style of the bag I, I really I mean the Speedy is so iconic right uh, same with the Alma but the Speedy more so for me I feel like if anything I would you know use this more than the Alma plus this one is the you know with the strap version so I will definitely use this way more than my Alma um, but I, I will still feature it in this video because I know that even though I did buy this and I know that I will you know use this bag because I will like the more comfortable strap more it's not a bag that I will always reach for uh, simply because of the size as well 
Uh, like I mentioned, because of my lifestyle, I just love bags that are on the smaller side just because they're just easy. I don't carry that much. I, I'm very minimalist in terms of what I carry um, as long as they fit what I need, right? So I know this is not such a huge bag either, but uh, on a daily basis, this pretty much is too big for me. So I know that I will love using this version more because of the leather but i will probably only pretty much limit myself to using it on day trips or whenever i know that i will be out the full day and i can't come home in between to change or whatever and i really do need to carry more but i don't feel like carrying my totes then this will come in handy like this this is the bag that i that's for those occasions and so i don't think those occasions will arise a lot uh, and therefore it will be my least one of my least used item only because i have a smaller collection i don't have you know that big of an extensive collection i only like to keep one of each type of model or whatever of of bags that i like so it will still be my lesser used bag but that is the reason why i am featuring it in this video not because i don't like it and my last luxury item or bag that i will feature um is my celine trapeze you guys know that I love this bag, and I still do, um, but it is also on the bigger side. Uh, of course, you know, my whole reasoning around this whole video is, is due to the size bags that are not always suitable for my lifestyle, which I think is a valid reason. I really love this bag. This is one of those bags that it, it makes such a great fashion statement, and um, it's just always... It's always a bag that I always look at and think that it's so good looking. It's one of those bags that not everyone has it and all that. Not that those things are super important, but that's just how I feel about it. Uh, but it will still be something that I don't use all the time. Plus this color and this shape, I feel is more appropriate for fall. So, you know, I, I feel like I, I tend to gravitate towards this bag when it's fall or winter. So I hope you enjoy my updated version of this tag video. Thank you, Minnie, for tagging me. Uh, like I said, in no way does it mean that I don't like these bags. It just really, really means that I, I really use these the least, but I still love using them. Uh, except my Alma PM, I really don't use it that much. Maybe once a year. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will try to tag a few people down below because I don't really know who else hasn't done it yet since I came back from vacation and obviously I have so many tag videos to catch up on um, as well as I think there's a few new ones floating around which um, I'm pretty interested in doing. That's it for this video and I will talk to you again very soon. Bye!